The who's who of Freestone County, local politicians, law enforcement, all invited to a courthouse rally and barbecue yesterday, hosted by Dallas developer Sean Todd. Now, Todd is fighting the Texas Parks Department, which is suing to stop him from turning the beloved Fairfield Lake State Park into a private development. Come and see. Delicious barbecue, happy faces. Dallas developer Sean Todd knows one way to win the hearts and minds of Freestone County is through their stomachs. Just days ago, he paid a record price for the county fair's champion steer. Todd just happens to also be promoting Freestone, his luxury gated development plan for land leased for the past 50 years by Fairfield Lake State Park. A few months ago, Todd outbid the Texas Parks Department when the land came up for sale. But now the State Park Board is taking the park land back legally, but by force, using eminent domain. You ask me, does the Texas Parks and Wildlife have the right to do the domain? It's my understanding that they do. Which is exactly why Todd is taking his case outside the Freestone County Courthouse to the not Court yet. of Public yeah, Opinion. They, if you're not for eminent domain, if you're not for eminent domain, I'm not going to call you out, but would you clap with me? Todd used the courthouse steps to litigate his case, suggesting that the chairman of the State Parks Department, the owner of Bucky's, Arch Applin, is, well, not breaking the law, but that forcing him to give up his land is un-Texan. But why didn't the chairman just speak up and say, I'm doing the same thing here that I've been doing to the Todds for the last several months, and I'm gonna do whatever the hell I wanna do. A small group of park supporters did show up. I planted over a thousand trees out there to keep it a park, not to make it a golf course. But it became clear that the protesters were not invited guests, only the supporters of the developer and the guys with badges. So I'm just coming out here to make sure everything remains peaceful on both sides. It also became clear that I had worn out my welcome as well. Red ships snooping into your press conference, by the way. You see, for months, Todd has refused to respond to my many phone calls and emails, and today only took one of my questions. I do have more questions. I do have more questions. Such as, how was Todd able to take over the courthouse plaza and command such an impressive law enforcement presence, who were more than happy to shield Todd from any unwanted questions? Did you let this gentleman know that all the interviews are over? Yes. You know, this is over. Hey, man. All the interviews are over, okay? All the interviews are over. There you go. Interview's over. Hey, Sean Todd brought along his attorney. Nice guy. In fact, he did answer all my questions. The key one is Todd willing to accept fair market value for his investment. The attorney told me, quote, if he can't do his development, he is looking for fair market value. And folks, that's how eminent domain works. We'll be right back. Stay with us.